Hello everyone, Mr. Merkage here, and today is just going to be a quick video uh, about the Skype tool series. Probably one of the last ones, actually. Uh, I've just got a couple more things to show you. Um, so yeah, let's just get right into it. Uh, what I'm going to show you first of all is how to clear the history of things. Uh, so if we copy this and get a couple of buttons in, uh, just get four buttons, and I'll change the names after. But we're basically just going to do Skype. Dot. Sorry, it's a bit laggy. Uh, clear call history for that one. Clear calls. Basically, what I'm showing you is uh, what some people have asked for. We're going to have clear chats. And it's pretty, this is pretty straightforward. Um, let's do clear chat history. And this one is the last one for here. Skype dot clear voicemail history. Well, basically, people are asking questions, but it's easy to find out yourself. So you've got to call Skype for everything to work. So if you type Skype dot, it will give you a whole list of everything that's available to you so you can use this and hover over it and it will tell you like what each thing does so if you can't work something out just use that and you'll find it yourself it's pretty straightforward clear the emails and the last one is reset cash case whatever uh, skype dot reset case. So that's that that will clear all your chats and stuff if you don't really if you say you've got a lot of contacts and they don't stop spamming you. That you can use that for that. Um, so that is them. Another thing I could show you is uh, there's something else I didn't do that you would like to see. Uh, I think that's it really, uh, that's all I can think of, I've, I've covered pretty much most of the stuff you really need to know, um, and like I said again if you type skype dot, um, it will give you a whole list of what you can use and what's available to use, uh, so that's it really, sorry the video is short but I'm coming to the end of the series and I'm running out of things to do. Um, so again, if you do have anything you do want, please leave a comment and I'll try my best to get it done for you. Uh, so yeah, if you did leave, if you did like the video, please leave a thumbs up and I'll see you next time.